There has been tremendous change in the number and types of treatment options that are available for advanced stages of kidney cancer in the last several years. Dr. Chua told my child that your mother has cancer. This is what she has done. She has done it for her husband. She has done it for her husband. She has done it for her husband. When I met this husband, I'm happy. The main focus in kidney cancer treatment has been about precision medicine. This approach identifies the right patient for the right medicine. We do this by looking at the molecular alterations in the cancer cells and selecting the drugs that target these molecular defects. First, it was a shock. And then to hear that, you know, she is the one who, who is unwell, it took us quite a while to sink in and the whole time we were trying to come to grips with it. She was on our back saying, no, this is not the end. More recently, immunotherapy agents use antibodies that target specific molecules on the surface of immunological cells such as PDL1 and CDLA4. In this way, we're able to offer personalized medicine or precision medicine to our patients with kidney cancer instead of offering everybody with a one-fit-all treatment plan. This our mission is about putting the patient first and so everything that we do in a patient's management plan is about putting the patient's needs first. The treatment that she's on, she doesn't, she's able to walk out at the end of it, doesn't feel like she's actually been on any medication or anything and still go back and being bubbly and her normal self. Um, you know, it, I think that really makes a huge difference. To treat our patients to the best of our ability, we need to encompass the entire patient as a whole, from their families to their caregivers to their belief system and their culture because we are treating each human person as a whole. <laughs>